everyone and welcome back to Turnips to Tangerines and welcome to the Wisconsin series. Today we are going to be talking about smoked fish and specifically um, smoked um, chubs, salmon, trout, whitefish, herring, and carp. Um, they're this is a company that is in Two Rivers, Wisconsin, and I will leave all their information in the description box below, like I always do for you. And um, this smoked fish from Lake Michigan is really a big thing here in Wisconsin. Believe it or not, we eat a lot of this smoked fish on crackers. We make, you know, meals out of it. I have a couple recipes on my blog, tangerines. Dot com and I'll leave those links at the bottom also I have a recipe for smoked salmon um, Alfredo I do believe and smoked salmon dip which any of the smoked fish you can substitute for you know the smoked salmon smoked white fish is excellent the herring is excellent I mean um, it's 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 very good if you like anything smoked you will love any of these products. This company is called Suzy Q's um, Fish Market. It, like I said, it's located in Two Rivers, Wisconsin, and it is a five generation company. It's family owned, operated. They do all their own fishing in Lake Michigan, and they catch whatever their limit or quota is, and then they smoke it right at their facilities also. And um, they've been in business since, oh, I think the 1940s. And like I said, it started out as just a fish market. They're located right on Lake Michigan, so that would make, you know, perfectly good sense. And then they started uh, serving fish and food, and then they got into the smoking fish to make them last longer. And they've been around, like I said, for a very long time, and it's family owned and operated. And uh, this is what it looks like. Um, there is even a place in Michigan, I can't think of the name of the tavern anyway anymore, but they serve um, Bloody Marys with a chub. If you, you know, I have a, also have a little series on my blog also that explains what a chub is. A chub is, I think, a form of a, uh, is a sam, or not salmon, is a herring family, I do believe. And I really don't want to, you know, I don't want to. Get my fingers all smelling like smoke here but this is what you do this is what we do this is what my family did my dad loved smoked fish and whenever the holidays were around I always remember you know having smoked chubs on the on the hors d'oeuvre table if you want to call it that back then um we just called it snacks the snack table we didn't call it hors d'oeuvres or appetizers it was just you know snacks for us so um this is what you do we put it out and um like i said it's good i like it you know and i've always eaten it and i think my dad and i always like to eat it but that's what we did and what you do is you're gonna if you're gonna serve it at a party I leave it whole like this if so if you can handle the head then you can cut that off it doesn't matter my husband would probably eat it inside whatever I mean you know that's the way he is if you can handle the tail you can do what you want with that also that doesn't bother me <laughs> well one thing that doesn't bother me but what you do is you kind of just peel back the top layer here of skin and you know like that just kind of peel it back and you go like that and kind of just peel it back I'm not going to do the whole thing because my husband isn't home today otherwise I would because he'd probably eat half of this so what you do is you just peel back the, the top layer of skin or you can cut it off it all depends how you like I said it all depends how you like it and then you peel it back like that and I can guarantee you right now my dogs are all circling around me going wow what does she have today Ooh, smoke fish. Wow, we haven't had that for a while. <laughs> and then what you do is you just serve it with the crackers like that. Uh, this is what I do. I mean, you can get fancy if you want. I don't. 
and I prefer a little fork. If you have even a smaller one, that's even better. And then you just kind of, you know, put your fork in here. Like I said, you can cut all that off if that doesn't appeal to you. And uh, you just take a little bit like that and kind of, you know. Now, I just took this out of the refrigerator, so the longer it sits out, you know, the better it gets. You can kind of look for a bone here and there. Which, is that a bone or isn't it? No, it's not. You know, you're not going to find much of it, and it is smoked. So and then you just go like that. That's, like I said, this is the way I do it. If you don't like it this way, hey, don't do it. I mean, you know, do what you want to do. Then you just kind of go like that. You put it on your little cracker there. Whoa. As much as you want, as little as you want. Ooh, I'm going to take a bite of this, only because I haven't had this since last Christmas, and it's actually good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. That's good. And fresh. Mmm. Wow, yeah, that's good. Well, that's what I do. Mmm. My dogs are going to love me today. They had the liver stuff, liver pate. All right, here's a little bone. I'm going to just take it out if you want. Mm-hmm. Well, if I can grab it. Yeah. Oh, right there. There we go. And they're big enough. So the bones are big enough that you can see. But anyway. And that's how we eat it here. That's how I serve my smoked. And this is herring. Smoked herring. My husband's favorite. He loves pickled herring. Which I can't do. I'm sorry. Pickled herring lovers. But I have tried. And I can't. I can eat any smoked fish in the whole wide world. But don't give me pickled herring. Because I just can't do it. But this is regular herring. I personally, myself, I prefer the um, white fish. It's more, um, oh, I don't know how to explain it. I just prefer the white fish. Uh, that's my favorite. And then I like the salmon, of course. Who doesn't like, you know, smoked salmon? Everybody. Stop jumping on the cupboard, Luke. You'll get some in a minute. You know, who doesn't like smoked salmon? You know, everybody does. And, um, but my favorite of all is the white fish, maybe because that's, you know, pretty, it's a, you know, Lake Michigan thing. So I prefer the white fish myself and then the salmon. And then I actually like the chubs. The chubs are a little bit more oily. So they're more oily, like I think they're more oily, almost like a tuna oily. And I like that also. And then we have the herring, which is my husband's absolute favorite. So we kind of buy, they didn't have white fish when I was there. Otherwise, I would have bought that for myself. But they didn't have any there. This stuff goes really fast. Um, you can buy this in Wisconsin year round. And um, if you, you know, don't want to buy it at the store and you're in Two Rivers or Manitowoc area, they have a lot of fisheries, fish markets there that smoke their own fish along um, the Lake Michigan coast there or line there, Manitowoc, Sheboygan, Two Rivers, or stop in Suzy Q's and order yourself some fresh fish. They also serve that, fish and chips. And, you know, enjoy a Wisconsin meal that you might not th thought or you might not have thought that we eat here. We eat a lot of lake perch trout a lot of fish from lake michigan so stop by and say hi at susie q's or any of the other stops along the way there and enjoy a fish dinner or pick up some smoked fish and have some smoked fish and crackers at your next party bye bye now and thanks for stopping by the wisconsin series see you next time